Women's History Month, and we're getting a deeper look into Idaho's history and the women who have made it here in the Gem State. And we're joined today by Hannah Lori Hine with the Idaho State Historical Society. Thank you so much for joining us of today. Of course, it's my pleasure. Yes, yeah, so, well, tell us what is the importance of the month? Why do we celebrate this month? Well, you know, we've been celebrating March as Women's History Month yeah. since early 1900s. Um, it was codified by Congress in 1980 and so it's been part of the national effort to really look at women and their contributions uh, over time. And of course it's important to do that wherever you live but especially here in Idaho because we have such amazing women in our past. We truly do. Uh, well speaking of amazing women in our past, can you tell us a little bit of those influential women that have really made a mark here in the Gem State? Well of course you know Idaho was the fourth state to grant suffrage to women so I can't talk about women's history and not acknowledge that there were suffragists, suffragists um, back in that time period who really made a mark here. Uh, one in particular who comes to mind is Margaret Roberts. And this is a woman who championed suffrage uh, really in the late 1800s and onwards in, into the early 1900s in advance of the passage of the 19th Amendment to the U.S. Constitution. She was a remarkable woman. She served as chair uh, and, and kind of the leader of the Idaho Traveling Library and was involved in a number of, of efforts. She even worked for the Historical Society for a time in the 1940s. Now, if people really want to dive in and understand and see how that looks like here in Idaho, where can they go? Are there any events that they can partake in? Well, you know, right now I know we're kind of ending the tail end of, of March for, for history, uh, Women's History Month, but the Idaho State Historical Society puts on events all the time across all of our sites, including the Idaho State Museum and the old Idaho Penitentiary and all of the information about those sites can be found on our website, which is history.idaho.gov. I mean, you said you said it yourself, we're, we're nearing the end of this, but it's always a great time to celebrate women. So what is the best way to honor and celebrate women he, all over the place and here in Idaho included? Well, I think it's important that you spend time with the women who are in your lives today uh, and capture their stories in whatever way you can, whether that's in writing or through audio recordings, um, because the only way we can tell the stories of the women from the past is if we have those records and so it's important to capture them while they are alive. It truly is important. Thank you so much for joining us of here to talk about this wonderful and important topic. Again, thank you. Uh, we'll be right back after this quick break.